did you make a friend? You tried to let him go and what happened? He jumped right on me. You held out your hand and he jumped right in it, didn't he? And then he jumped up your leg. <laughs> Liam set him down and said, you're free to go in the wild. And he jumped right into his hand. He says, I'll hang out with you for a little bit longer. My jumping friend. He says, I saw you jumping and you're a pro. <laughs> Good jumpers. You're going to trip. You're going to trip over the walnuts. I already picked up all the walnuts in this area. <laughs> and there's just as many falling again. All right, put them in. Put them in the wagon. Pick them up. You're not going to help me, are you? You watching those cows eat? <laughs> They're so cute. Who wouldn't want to watch cows eat? They're so cool. <gasps> look who's coming. Look behind you. Look who's, look who's coming. It's baby Bowser. Bowser! Are you coming to see us? No. He turned around. <laughs> you want to see the chaos. <laughs> you love your cows. They're sweet. <laughs> Bowser, you are so fat. <laughs> Mama, you are looking good, too. I think we're feeding them maybe a little too much. I'd rather have them a little bit hefty going into winter, though. Oh, that's not on it. Ayo. Oh, you're feeling so good. Thank you, Mama. Mmm, pink snacks. Got a bunch of starting to rot pumpkins that we gotta go ahead and hurry up and feed them all before they get too gross. How's the way you doing? Is that just the right spot to itch? <laughs> Pigs are fun. Got some pumpkins and some walnuts. We're gonna see if they like. You think you like them, Peaches? What are you doing? You wanna give some to the pigs? You wanna give some to the pigs? So I've had a lot of people tell me that pigs love black walnuts. I've been a little afraid to give them to them because I know that too much black walnut can be toxic. Mama, say, will she eat them? I noticed that the boys had some black walnuts above them that were falling into their pen and they weren't eating them. So. Yeah, not sure about this. My pigs are not black walnut fans, it appears. Oh, maybe they are. Nope. Nope. I already know the boys aren't eating them. Strange. What I know she does like is some pumpkins. Oh, <laughs> Bowser's like, I like pumpkins. There she goes. Chomp, chomp, chomp. These little mini pumpkins are not the tastiest, but they're still, is this still food? Side note, the chickens. 
are interested in the walnuts. And I think that's because of the whole maggots, or whole worms is a nicer way to call it. There's little bugs that parasitize the outer hell of the black walnut. And the chickens were probably interested in that, attracted by that. Chickens are great to clean up after other animals, aren't they? <laughs> well, Bowser's eating a walnut. Oh. Test. I don't know if his jaw is strong enough to bite through the shell. Come on, cows! Come on, cows! Come on, cows! Lash is friendship. Come on! Need you out of here now. Gotta get it set up for the piggies. Come on! Come on, cows! Here, I'll watch the gate. You. Gotta watch the gate because Bill's gonna try to sneak out. We wanna keep him in there if possible. Even though we know we can catch him again. Come on, cows! Come on, cows! Come on, Bridget. Come on, cows. Come on, Lashes. There they go. Come on, cows. Good girls. Good girls. Good girls. They're like, ooh, yeah. That grass had a chance to grow up for us. That was a good, nice little short rest for this pasture. Now that the season is slowing down on the growth rate. All right, so now we're gonna take down this fence around the coonies. We're gonna move it up into here. Give them a section right here to rotationally graze. Ryan's taking it down. We pretty much trust that Bowser and Peaches will stay with us. So we're not worried about them going anywhere while we move the fence. Should be pretty easy to get them where we want them to go. <laughs> Peaches is like not even aware that there's no more fence. <laughs> She's just chilling. Uh, she's like, this is my area. I'm gonna lay down. <laughs> she's such a chill little pig. Big pig. Hi. All right, we've got the electric net fence set up. We're gonna use the solar charger all by itself on one fence so that it's strong enough. They've got the tarp area for shelter from the rain. We'll build another pallet shelter for them up here for the winter. Once it starts to get cold, they'll have that. We've got the fence down right here. Our water is going to go right here and Wallow will be in this corner. But we're going to bring Peaches and Bowser in this way. Pretty cool! <laughs> we spent all that time putting up the fence. Over here. Peaches hasn't moved! <laughs> she has no idea that there is not a fence around her. You have no clue, do you? Hi, Mama. Come on, Peaches. Come on, Peaches. Come on,
wants to follow him. Bread is one of the staples of life. Use bread to catch fish. Use bread to make sandwiches. Now, using bread to lure pigs. <laughs> Sacrificing our kids' lunch. Turning point. Come on. Push that gate closed, Daddy. Push that gate closed. Push that gate closed. Push that gate closed. Ha <laughs> ha. Right. Now bonus points. All right, we got her in the paddock. If I can get her into the electric net fence without her getting spooked by walking over a fence, that'd be great. Slightly bigger pieces. Oh, I know. Over here. Follow the breadcrumbs. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We're we'll a whole bunch right here, and then I'm gonna come over the top of her if I can get her. Full loaf when we started. Oh my goodness, pigs! Aww. Pigs! Bill and Peaches and Bowser united. Reunited and it feels so good. <laughs> You're so good. You're so good. Now I just gotta hook up the electricity. And now the doghouse goes back to its original use. Move Titus over here so that the cows can use the original use of that shelter, which was for cows. So the cows have a shelter, the dog has a shelter, and we will be building a pallet wall and ceiling for these guys shortly. They're fighting over a pumpkin. Bill is running around with a little mini pumpkin in his mouth. You like those pumpkins? They're yummy, huh? <laughs> so, we have Lashes back in the buck pen. She's just in there in the buck shelter eating some of his hay. And she's in here again because she got out again. She found a new spot and she broke through a new area. So, man. I would just wish we could just fence the entire back side of the property with regular fence instead of barbed wire, but it's just not in the budget or the time limits that we have right now. So she is in timeout pen. Meanwhile, the Coonies are loving their area. They're doing a good job in staying in. They have a couple of ducks in there visiting them right now. Mama friendship 
is out there. She doesn't go far. When her baby's in here, she doesn't go in the woods. She stays nice and close. But the Cooney Cooney rotational fence is up and functioning. So that was a good thing for us to be able to accomplish this weekend. Right, Bill?